Hello guys, uh, great tutorials here. Uh, with a new tutorial for you guys. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm gonna sh be showing you uh, like a zoom in effect. You have probably seen it uh, on pretty much all my edits. I have used this effect. It's real nice and I love it. So uh, I just wanna explain why I've been why I haven't been uploading that much uh, I've been sick really sick I couldn't like be able to talk to talk um, yeah but I'm still pretty sick but I feel much better but yeah let's go into the tutorial so this is what we're going to make like that zoom effect looks really good uh, Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Okay, so um, I will just uh, start with the tutorial. So what I have here is a clip and uh, my color correction. Um. So yeah, that's basically it. So. Uh, the clip is basically jumps here and get one pretty sexy clip not gonna joke or anything uh, okay okay so first of all uh, what you wanna do is just add in a uh, optic compensation blah 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 yeah <laughs> uh, I don't know what uh, that is but yeah, you wanna go to the when you see the muscle flash where it shoots, like there, and you wanna go to your optics comparison. Yeah, you wanna drag the field view, view, and you wanna check the re reverse lens distortion, and there you go. There's like the effect itself. Uh, so I will put this effect around 155. I think it's perfect. And then you wanna click the keyframe. Then click U and just go f back a little bit and put it to zero. And then go like that and put it to zero. Uh, and now you wanna highlight them and right click. Uh, let me see. Right click keyframe assistant and easy ease. And then you wanna go uh, and search slider control. Drag that in. And open that up. Yeah, open that up. And hold shift and click P. And then hold alt and click on the, the position clock watch. Um, so we're basically going to do a wiggle expression so wiggle uh, like that bracket things uh, I don't know what it's called but yeah uh, uh, let me see here uh, okay 9 comma then you wanna click this and slip wick to the slider okay and then you wanna make another like a very blah blah. <laughs> uh, sorry guys, I don't know what that that is. Okay, so what you wanna do is you wanna go to the first keyframe at your um, optics comparison. Yeah. Uh, you wanna click the slider, make it zero, and then go to the middle where it shoots, and put it to sixty-five. Way uh, and then go to the end uh, and then make it zero. Highlight them and when I highlight them and right click key from assistant, assistant ECs. Yeah, uh, four minutes. Okay, uh, so what we have really now is the whole effect. Like bam, but you might like click on scale and maybe drag it 
out a little bit like 106 or something and now we basically have this effect uh, like zooms in and BAM um, so just highlight that and look and see how it looks basically um, wait a bit okay so I will surrender this in third oh shit what happens okay something is messing with my after effects but yeah this is the fake like that and now to add the uh, if i have time yeah okay uh, so now to add the uh, like the sound uh, before it shoots it's like a um, like a thingy sound is check out that video again uh, here is the sound and an uh, explosion sound uh, to make that just go to the download link in the description or yeah just go and put in a like a intervention sound the intervention sound is good uh, I know this is the MSR but yeah it's good then you wanna put this at the muscle flash of course uh, then you want to duplicate it two times and one of them are going to go right click time and reverse time layer um, and you want to right click on that and go to time to, uh, time sketch put it to minus uh, like 150 um and then on the other one you wanna go the same rehearse rehearse time layer yeah um basically like this to make it a little bit better you just go to yeah I will have all these uh uh files in the description like uh just go and download that but it's a uh, explosion doll sound and just drag that on and put it at LL and oh L I mean and put it up to about four and what you can do is wait I have time no not really okay but yeah guys uh, I'll just try to ram preview this uh, let's see here I'll just try something okay there you go uh, okay guys so this is the final effect I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and everything um, leave a like and a comment below and yeah this is the final effect like that sounds pretty goddamn awesome. Yeah, uh, yeah. If it's too fast or too slow, you just drag out these keyframes. Um, yeah, guys, uh, leave a comment and a like below, please. And um, yeah, see you in another tutorial. Bye.